Nagbabalik tayo dito sa Kababayan Today. Pinag-uusapan po natin ang mga issue na nangyayari sa Pilipinas that we should all take part in and be involved. Let's uh, get to know what these uh, issues are. Napaka-importante po na uh, miski nandito tayo sa Amerika, nalalaman pa rin natin kung ano ba talaga nangyayari sa Pilipinas. So, the Philippine Congress once again tried to pass the charter change, ang tinatawag natin na cha-cha, before the break, but failed to... Uh, Congressman Colmenares, do you think that they would again try to pass it after the State of the Nation address o tinatawag na SONA? Well, it's live. Yeah, they will try to pass it again. The problem with Chacha is you're going to amend the Constitution to allow more foreign entry into the country. You know, if, if you do that, you amend the Constitution, then big transnational corporations, mining firms will rape mountains and mountains of our, of our forests. And, you know, you grant them ownership of land. Uh, under the Constitution, foreigners are not allowed to own land. Uh, well, our Kababayans here, because they were formerly Filipinos, they're allowed to own land. Mm -hmm. But, you know, foreigners talagang, you know, non-Filipinos are not allowed. And I think there's wisdom in that constitutional provision. The moment foreigners buy land, it, the prices would shoot up. I mean, hirap na nga bumili. Um, some of our Kababayans want to retire in the Philippines mm -hmm. and, you know, mahirap, mahal na rin. Mahal na nga, di ba? Oh, you oh. buy 10,000 pesos per square meter, medyo mahirap na rin. Oo, oh, oh, sa Makati man lang, ano, 50, 70,000 yes. na. Precisely. If a Japanese comes in and say, oh, I'll buy that for 100,000 pesos per square meter, then saan tayo pupulutin, oh, di ba? So maraming kamag-anak din natin doon will also be homeless na rin kasi wala oh, na silang matirhan. Pero Plus, hindi lang naman ito ang charter change na yeah, gusto. Entry. Uh, all public utilities, foreigners allowed, uh, corporations, mining allowed, education allowed, uh, land can be bought. So it's opening up the country to, foreign, to foreigners. So we're saying... That's a problem. In, in, in West Philippine Sea, you're complaining because China is occupying our territory, but in the Philippines, you're going to sell them lands with titles. What if they buy the entire beachheads of Mindoro and Palawan? They have a landing site. Okay. There's a security implication too. So in any case, we were against it, and we think the, the, the solution should be industrialization. Okay. And government focusing on capital, on local industry, local businesses, steel industry, for example. How can we ever develop G? We cannot even produce our own nails. Pako lang hindi natin ma-produce. How can you develop? We don't mm -hmm. have a steel industry. Mm -hmm. So there was a steel industry during the time of Marcos. So we're, why shouldn't we do that now, di ba? So mm -hmm. government always say, walang kasing kapital eh. I disagree. Government has capital. You just want to spend your capital on bridge that leads to nowhere or roads that are, you know, Yon, pork barrel. Yun, pumupunta sa mga pockets ng mga corrupt officials. Okay, yes. I want to know before we end our show, it's been very informative. Thank you, Thank you very Thank much. You. Um, but what can we do here as Kababayans? We want to get involved. Think, we want to see change. Well, I think, yeah, you're right. I think my ma maraming Kababayan dito would really want to see change oh, in the oh. Philippines. For one reason, some of them want to retire there someday oh, oh. and they want the Philippines na peaceful, yes. not, you know. And develop. The what second, is your recommendation yeah. for us then? Well, for us to get involved in the issue. For example, in, in the pork barrel, you, you can sign the People's Initiative. Mm -hmm. In the SSS, you can write to the Senate and say, because it needs a Senate approval pala. We pass it in the lower house, the, the SSS, mm -hmm. 2,000 peso increase. You can write to the Senator and say, put your money where your mouth is. You approve the SSS pension bill. A Senator comes over, you tell the Senator, Issue a public statement, you're against pork barrel. Now, things like that will help uh, a lot in the country. So I guess the, our, our interest of reforming the country must not be divorced from our, you know, dahil nandito na tayo, wala na tayong pakialam. Okay. I see a lot of people. All right. Well, thank you. Uh, you know, we've run out of time. Unfortunately, may balita tayo na tatakbo daw kayo sa Senado. Totoo ba ito? Well, Before we go to break. Well, there is a, a proposal that I run for the Senate. Hindi ako mayaman. Three terms in Congress. Okay. So I don't have the resources for that. And, okay. Uh, uh, so we will see if we are, we are able to see you running in the near future. Maraming, maraming salamat, salamat po. Thank you thank for the you. opportunity. Maraming salamat for watching. Kababayan today. We'll see you all again next time. Ako po si G. Tanji. Thank you.